Well, hello there. I'm Calum Johns, and this is an update. And a bit of talking to you guys, because I might as well get straight to it. I, as of recording this video, have just launched my Patreon page. Now, this was because I saw on YouTube updating its things where I had to send in my tax information to the to them for when I get monetized, as well as also helping with my work going into the film industry and also being able to do stuff here. I do plan on getting a regular schedule back up and going. It should help now that Patreon could make me more accountable with actually doing live streams of me editing. You get a bonus of that and some other things. So that would be good for you guys. And would it also help upgrade my setup here depending on where I end up allocating the money and where my priorities lay at the time a little bit. For example, with money I got from Twitch, from just streaming on Twitch, I bought this mic arm. Which would be super handy for better audio quality as far as being able to speak straight into a close microphone compared to it being further away be better as well as if I'm moving back oh look I can just move it with me that works out I mean little adjustment but hey that will happen whatever happens with the mic up so that sort of thing also I plan to be doing short films to work on going into the film industry so this money if you support me will help go towards that as well i will just need to budget and go towards all of that at the moment my goals on there you can find the link in the description below are uh, connected to creating content and stuff for you guys and that sort of thing but for now and that can also be a thing that you think about when you see that I have a patron. But yes, got a mic arm as well. That's a new thing. I'm sort of vlogging here, so I might as well talk about that. It's so nice to actually be able to go, oh, I have this money from streaming on Twitch, which I am doing more often than actually uploading to YouTube. So I need to work out the balance a little bit. But the main reason for that is because I can just jump on, stream on Twitch, have a good time, and then that's sort of done. Compared to YouTube where I have to record the video, edit it, and then upload it. And I will usually schedule it to come out at a time where I know that it's safe, rather than going, oh, whoops, I missed the detail of something just as it goes up when it finishes uploading. So there's that too. But yeah, I've done a couple of videos. I was planning to have a third video out about the Hasbro Fan Choice polls, but by the time that would come out at the moment, <laughs> it's pretty much already over. Now it's good we're getting the Republic Trooper to come out and that sort of thing. And they're re-releasing some old vintage collection Hasbro figures. So that's pretty cool. The Patreon will help so much if you want to. There's also a link to donate directly through Streamlabs tips if you feel so inclined and be able to go towards that. Out of interest, from pricing that I've seen at the moment, an audio interface to get my Rode NTG2 microphone with an XLR cable plugged into it that I have for film equipment would cost about $300 to do that. <laughs> So I'm saving up some money as well towards getting film equipment and also I'm looking at getting some Aperture Amaran 200X by colour lights that should be better for filming and that money, any money that comes towards that I will see if I end up allocating part of it towards film gear compared to going oh I want to just upgrade this setup and all the stuff I'm doing here because at the moment I'm going fairly well, I believe, with what I'm doing on YouTube and Twitch and having fun that way. So yeah, I've got a Patreon now because I also thought that for all the stuff I'm doing, I was going to monetize at 1000 subscribers, but given some information about YouTube and how it's going to take a big cut if I do get monetized, 
I thought if you want to support me, especially on the Twitch side where I'm streaming a lot more, that is a very valid way to do it. Also offering on Patreon is I'm going to share as I edit videos, I'm going to stream them, probably as unlisted YouTube links, and you'll actually get access to archives of my Twitch streams unlisted on YouTube, and I will upload, I will up export. I won't put too much effort into ex editing them or anything, but I can upload them and you can watch them back if you want to. Find some good clips and that sort of stuff, which would be good. Starting from when my Patreon has gone up and when I start a new game with that, or I think that it's enough game that I'll keep uploading it to there. But yeah, anyway, and that's that. I don't know what else to say about it. I really appreciate if you guys do feel like supporting me. You don't have to, there's no obligation, but that's the step I'm taking towards this because I feel like if I just make YouTube videos without getting any money back at the moment, that's great. I have fun with it, but at the same time, I don't put as much energy into it. And if I see that I'm getting something more from it, you would actually get more content as well and we would actually be seeing better content for all across the board because i will be working on short films and stuff which will need money to make a lot better and it'll be good but i may also go into different movie reviews and stuff i still need to record some reviews of comics i'm changing the way i'm doing it i've been procrastinating because i have to change the way i'm doing it change is never easy <laughs> but hey i'm having fun and if you've got a topic for me, shoot it in the comments and I will think about it. I tend to do ones off the top of my head a lot more because those are easier, require less time to research. And also, whatever else I'm doing on my stream, unlisted to Patreon as well, such as a short stories compendium I'm working on for Sales Expanded Universe and putting in those stories and my any updates to my Star Wars Expanded Universe timeline, which include quite a story to tell of the new sort 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 story. The new short story from Star Wars The Old Republic, which connects into the expansion, so that's really good. We get some new EU in the form of a short story. But I will talk about that next time. So thank you guys again. Huge thank you if you do decide to support me. I thought I would make a separate video so everyone is aware that follows my channel that I do have that. Otherwise, keep enjoying my videos. And I will see if I can muck around and give some thoughts on other movies, give some thoughts, do some little short film bits, and that'll be good. So thank you guys, and I'll see you next time. Hey, Ray.